Hi everyone, today we're going to learn how to clean a nail polish bottle without using acetone. So I took out uh, as much nail polish as possible out of the bottle. Then I poured some baby oil into the bottle, about a quarter of the way, you don't need a ton. And then I used a wooden stirring stick, you can also use a, a skewer. And so what I did is I was squishing, swishing the oil around, not squishing. <laughs> And then I was scraping the edges of the bottle so that I could soak the nail polish with the oil. And you can already see the oil doing its thing. And what happens is once the oil touches the nail polish, it solidifies the nail polish and it makes it stickier so it sticks to the wooden stir. And see how it all uh, bunches up? So now I'm going to use a skewer. It's a little thicker. So all I did was just uh, keep on, see, it all bunches up. And so then I just kept on swooshing the oil in there and see that it balled up again and that's what you're going to keep on doing. And what I love about this is you don't have to deal with the acetone with the harsh smell of it. The baby oil works great. Your hands don't get all dry. Now to help the process even further, I use some Q-tips to wipe down the edges even further. And then we can work on the top part of the bottle. Now I used a cotton round to get to the ridges of the outside of the bottle. Now using a, the wooden skewer and a small piece of cotton, I'm scraping down the edges even further just to make sure that I get all that nail polish out of there. And I do suggest using a small piece of cotton and taking it out every so often because the nail polish does solidify on top of the cotton ball. So then it's going to turn into a big hard ball if you don't take it out. Now using a cotton ball, a cotton Piece, I should say. I pressed it against the edge of the very top of the nail polish bottle to get to that ridge before you hit the top. I am so out of frame here. I was just getting all into the cleaning, but and you just keep doing that. Just keep, you know, changing, switching out cotton balls or cotton pieces out just to make sure that all the, the, the inside of the bottle is nice and clean. Now to clean the little ridges at the very top of the outside of the bottle, I cleaned it with a napkin and with the tip of the wooden skewer, I took off all the hardened nail polish. It's super easy to dupe since the oil does soften it up a little bit. Now for the top, I just took out the little brush and I did the same thing with the inside of the cap. And I did the same thing with a toothpick. I scraped out all the hardened nail polish. And now to get rid of all the oily residue, what do is we're gonna wipe it down with some 91% isopropyl alcohol. And this will get rid of all the oily residue I poured some inside and then I shook it, just shake it for a few minutes just to make sure that all the oil is removed. Now 
And I poured it out and then with a small little rag, I dried the inside just to make sure that all the oil was removed. Now, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with these bottles yet, so if you have an idea for me, I'll leave a comment, let me know how is it that you would use these bottles. I just think that some of these bottles are beautiful, like this design of this particular brand, I absolutely love. I love it's like the clean lines, uh, triangular shape. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with these, so if you can give me an idea, it'd be great. Leave me a comment or send me a picture and let me know. And don't forget to do the inside of the cap with the alcohol just to make sure it's nice and oil free. And there you have it. Look how beautiful they are. Let me know what is it that you like about this tutorial. And like I said, leave me a comment. What is it that you suggest I do with these? Thanks and don't forget to subscribe. Let me know what you think. Bye.